Hi everyone, it's uh, December 15th. This is Sister Anne, Ambassador for Jesus Christ. So what Jesus Christ told me about um, the Trump, Trump times that we're in, President Trump will be the next president. Okay, they will fight against him, but they will not prevail. He's anointed of the Lord. He's listening to God's counsel, and he himself has been chosen for the position that he's in. Um, so also, God wants me to tell you that there's going to be a turnaround in the church. Okay, I was praying about this because many of the churches have fallen to a prosperity gospel. And God said that there, there is going to be a turnaround. So that's good news. And uh, Jesus also wanted me to tell you how you can escape the rapture. You can escape the rapture, Jesus said, by giving out missionary books, Bible books. You can get them free from missionarypress.com. Giving these everywhere you go, especially targeting the youth and high school and college, college age kids. Grade school too. Um, God also spoke to me and told me um, to relay to you uh, the messages of the Lord, of course, that that um, the church taught a key role in early America. And he wants us to get back to a small town mentality, to holiness, and to keep the commandments of the Lord, and to follow the, the commandment of being on the Great Commission. I always talk about that because Christ... He talks about that a lot. Um, so I'm making a plea for God to his people to not be apathetic, not be um, take this as, you know, just another day. Listen, the God's kingdom is 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 um, in order. Um, he's very organized. So the body of Christ, we want to work as one. We want to use our gifts um, on earth to build up his kingdom, edify the body of Christ, fulfill the needs of the community. And, and number one, to bring souls into the kingdom of light from darkness. So if the kingdom of darkness was divided, it would not stand. So we as the kingdom of light do not want to be divided. Folks, we're playing for keeps, we're playing for eternity, okay? Um, so salvation is a gift, but we're in contract with God. We have a covenant with God to keep to keep on the command to keep the commandments, to pray for each other as well, and and to be on the Great Commission, okay? And um, we shouldn't be letting um, differences divide us. We should sit down and, and speak. Everybody has um, a viewpoint, but we should all have, be uh, under one accord, one mind and one heart. And if you have the Spirit of God and you're listening what the Scriptures are saying, you're listening to the Apostles' Creed, the New Testament, um, you're listening to what God commanded of us. And um, we're servants. We're servants, and if we're not serving God, we're either serving ourselves or we're serving the enemy. We're a tool used by Satan. Okay, that's why. That's why the people in the world that don't don't understand the Holy Spirit, the presence of God, they come against it and persecute because they're they're in the world. They're worldly minded, or they justify their sin. You know, we've got to be a special, peculiar people and work together. Okay, so um, let's work together as the kingdom of light and let's go give out these little books that God's talking about, um, you know, often. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. He's just talking about little track books. It's, it's, it's a bad lighting, but it, little, little gospel tracks, missionary press, and work together as one unit. And somebody might have a ministry gift of um, charity. Another one might have a, a ministry gift of singing. Let's use our, our gifts for God's sake, okay? Not to justify our, our sin anymore, okay? Thank you.